Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> My friends, this is Irma Rombauer. Mrs. Joy. The first edition of The Joy of Cooking took me a year to write. Only a year? Including testing the recipes? <laughs> oh, 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 well, I didn't really test all the recipes. There were so many of them. And then I found a publisher, a small printer in St. Louis. How much money did he pay you? I paid him $3,000. $3,000? A small fortune. But I had a little life insurance money because my husband... No. He killed himself? Yes. And I thought, well, what else am I going to do with the insurance money? And then the book began to sell, and Bob's Merrill picked it up, so now I had a real publisher. Oh. And they gave you some money? Absolutely not. They swindled me. They stole my copyright, and now there's a new edition, and guess what? What? The index is a complete calamity. If you're looking for city chicken, you're not going to find it under C. Really? It's under drumsticks mock. No. All she wanted to talk about was how her publisher had cheated her out of thousands of dollars and royalties. It just made me realize this not going to be simple, this getting published business. This is from Avis for you. Oh! Oh! Oh, my. Oh, Avis loves my sauce chapter. Oh, that's wonderful, she... darling. Oh, no. She showed it to someone, which I specifically asked her not to do. She showed it to an editor at Houghton Mifflin in Boston, and the Boston editor showed it to the head of publishing. And Paul, Paul. Yes. Paul, Paul, Paul. What? 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 They want to. They want to publish our book. Oh, that's great news. And they want to give us an advance. How much? Two hundred and fifty dollars. No. And when the book is finished, five hundred dollars more. I'm so proud of you. The editor loves the book. Oh, she, she just loves it. Mm -hmm.